Russian forces continue their advance into southern and eastern Ukraine. Russia said its forces shot down four HIMARS and Uragan rockets on Saturday and also intercepted four high-speed anti-radiation air-to-surface missiles. Moscow released aerial footage showing a kamikaze drone striking a UK anti-aircraft missile system belonging to the Ukrainian army. Kiev said its troops held back many attacks despite being constant. Ukraine said it continues to strengthen its defenses in the eastern Ukrainian city of Bakhmut, reporting more than 500 Russian troops being killed or wounded over the last 24 hours. Well, we spoke to a BRICS representative for South Africa who said the Russia-Ukraine conflict has been prolonged extensively due to military support from the U.S., NATO and the European Union. He says the global economy is also suffering the consequences of the conflict. We know that this is not a conflict just between Russia and Ukraine. On the contrary, what we are seeing is that Ukraine is involved in a proxy war between USA and Russia, between NATO and Russia, between EU and Russia. And this is what makes this a very complex conflict because what we are seeing at a time when you have major devastation on the global economy, uh, the massive resources that is being pumped into Ukraine by NATO, by EU member states, by the US, in terms of the trillions of dollars on arms and armament 